anyway, so bought out that hole there. Um, didn't actually have a screw. I didn't actually have a drill small enough, so I just used um, the tools and bought it out a bit. So I got black stuff everywhere. Okay, um, so drop the um, board back in. Um, and the trick is getting that to line up and just uh, before you close it, just give it a test. Yep, up and back. Cool. Then on HD, up to you. Um, and then make sure your mic swivels. And as you can see, my cable is rubbing there, so I need to get that to sit over there when it goes in. There's plenty of room there. Um, now, I didn't have a, a screw, a drill bit small enough for what I wanted. So I just ended up boring it out with that. Just twisting that around using um, the Phillips head screwdriver to bore it out. Um, so there's the hole, a bit larger than it was before. And that's for the external case. We've also got the case around the um, the actual camera when it needs boring out too. So, next thing you do, which I always get wrong, is you've got to feed th everything through before closing up. So, we're just feeding. Feeding it through and looking at that, those cables should sit over there somewhere. Um, I want to do it a bit tighter than that. Okay. You can see a lot in the unit itself by looking down through the arm. battery bay. Nice. Gonna click, gonna click. Cool. Alright. Screen swivel. Alright, this is looking good. Um just had a check the battery fits so there's nothing in the way. Yep, so So now what I'm going to do is um, wire this on, and I'm going to give it another test. Now it's just a case of putting it back all back together. So as you can see here, I have camera wire coming out for about 30 centimeters there, so I can decide whether I put it into my helmet joiner. Just a, I think they call it a 12 mil audio plug. 3.5 mil a meter audio plug. So should I find this microphone very good? I can only just put another mic on there. And that's spliced there. So I've done those together now. So that's the wire, right, there they go. Okay, so. That needs to sit. I'll just lock that in. As it will. As it would when it's on the camera. Back down. There it is. And these tabs hold the thing. As well as this lock.
Security doesn't actually have have a hole. It's basically going into the thread that holds the lens on. So you really don't want to overdo it. That's that. So now I should be able to turn that nice and just I'll leave it there. That's where I leave it on the helmet anyway. Um, that's it. My camera with an external.